June's new nursery. Everything in this room is super special to us. It's all come from different places and chapters in our life and it's all here in one room for her. A lot of the stuff in this nursery is actually recycled from when we first made her nursery, which was when we were living in a one bedroom apartment in Portland. So when we were living in Portland, we had just a tiny, tiny closet nook to decorate for June. So we have the crib, which is a mini crib because that's all the space that there was. We have a special little mini crib that she still fits in for now. And then for like the decor, like the mobile, it's handmade. Um, we really wanted things that were kind of like handmade. This is actually from a local artist up in Portland. We got it on Etsy and the same thing with the felt balls. And then moving on, we have like this little storage bin, which again was in June's nursery before, but this actually was with us in the van. So if you don't know, we went on this road trip, which is where June was actually conceived in a van. We were traveling all across North America and this was in our van. So it's really cool that it's here in the nursery. And then up above we have June's little elephant piggy bank from Tiffany's, which was a very special gift for when she was born. And then the baby monitor, which has a cute little sunflower ring around it so that it doesn't just stick out as a baby monitor. Moving on over here. So we've got these curtains. These curtains were also in the van. We've literally had them from our first apartment in Portland way, way back, and then in the van when we left to travel across North America. So these curtains have gone quite a ways with us. So we've got these curtains, and then we put cute little fairy lights behind just to make it a little bit more magical for June's room. And then down below the window, we have a really special gift that Aunt Missy made for June. This lovey is just super special because it has the rabbit, which was in Ollie and Finn's playroom, and also the trim, the maroon trim, was from Missy's bridesmaid dress when she was in our wedding. So it's just a really special handmade gift. We love it, and June loves it too. Also, we have from my baby shower this beautiful tree, and it has fingerprints of all the guests that went to the baby shower. So June will have that in her room as well. Oh, and on the tree, there's a cute little C plus K for Corbin and Kelsey carved into the tree. It's so cute. <laughs> and in this little storage cube area, there's just like a bunch of different toys, her stuffed animals, extra blankets, all kinds of stuff. And then moving on, this is the nursing chair. We have the nursing chair, which we've made a little bit cozier with the sheepskin rug and this comfy pillow. And then up above is this glass globe that I actually blew when we were living on the coast in Lincoln City right before we moved back to Portland for the second time. So this was super special. I knew when I was making it that I really wanted it to be somewhere where June would look up while she was like nursing or snuggling. And it's in your nursery, your second nursery. And then finally we've got this green dresser which is actually from like the very first time we started vlogging like three, four years ago. So this has been with us for a while and just way, way different chapter in our life, which is kind of cool. And on top of the dresser, we have this hand-cut silhouette, which is from when June went to Disneyland for the very first time. It was such a special memory. And then we have this book that was actually handmade from one of you guys, and we think is super special. And then above the dresser, we have this photo canvas that we blew up from photographs of when we were revealing Juniper's name. If you missed that name reveal video, we put so much time into it and it was just like so much fun to create and we just really kind of embraced like all these sort of nature elements and it was just super fun. So we captured that with a photo and we definitely knew we wanted that in her nursery someday. So we blew it up and put it on canvas and there it is. Also on the dresser is all of her, or most of them, they, she actually has way more, but a lot of her headbands and like hair accessories and almost all of these headbands were made at my baby shower. So all the guests who went to the baby shower, they made headbands, a bunch of headbands for little Miss Juniper, so she's got plenty. And then moving on to this area of the room, we've got Juniper's calendar, which we have fallen behind on, but this calendar we have been documenting all of her like big first or big memories we've been just putting it all in the calendar because even though we film every single day it's easy to 
lose track of what happened on which day. So it's really nice to have this calendar for that. And then on this side, we have these hand-painted prints that are probably one of my favorite things in the room. I don't know why, I just love these so, so much. And we have kind of put different meanings behind each of them. So in our minds, we think like the bear is the protector, the deer kind of symbolizes her innocence, Juniper's innocence, and then the raccoon kind of symbolizes like her playfulness, her like troublemaker curious side. So those are probably one of my favorite things in the room. <laughs> Finally is the J, which we put on the outside of the door. So to Juniper's room, she's got her J on there. And this was another homemade gift from her Gigi. Yeah. Another super special thing. Hi, Bug. Do you like your room? I think you like it. It's just really fun for her to have her own room. She's been taking lots of really good naps in here and going to sleep for part of the night. And I just can picture so many fun memories of her. You just picture so many fun memories of her just playing in here and yeah. I just think it's a really special room. Say thumbs up if you like my new room, my very own room. Thumbs up if you liked it. Leave a comment below. What is your favorite part of the nursery? We want to know. Leave those comments down below. And be sure to subscribe because we put up videos every single day. And we'll see you tomorrow. Be your feet are.